Hey, what's up everybody? It's Dallas with Gadget Hacks, and today I'm going to show you how to fix a stuck button on your smartphone. Now this isn't really groundbreaking stuff or anything, but I just wanted to show you how I would do it in case you find yourself in a situation where you want to follow along and do it yourself. And by stuck button, I don't mean a completely broken button. I just mean a button that's gotten gunky, maybe a little spongy, and just really hard to press. This is generally because the area in between the button housing and the button itself, so that little tiny gap you see there, has gotten gunked up with stuff from your pocket and just anything else the phone has picked up. And in my opinion, the best way to remove gunk like that and get your button working again is to grab some isopropyl alcohol and a few Q-tips. So to start, I'd take a Q-tip and dip it in some isopropyl alcohol, preferably as high a percentage as you can get. And get it nice and saturated, but shake off the excess. You don't want this dripping into your phone. From here, turn your phone completely off, and even pull the battery if you can, just to be on the safe side. Then to start, you basically want to wipe the sides of the part of the button that's sticking out from your phone. And I can't really do it like this in the video, because you wouldn't be able to see it, but if you can swing it, turn the phone upside down to where gravity will prevent the alcohol from seeping into the phone. But yeah, just very gently and carefully Go around the edges of that stuck button. Try to press the Q-tip down into the gap as much as possible there and just keep cleaning it as best you can. When you're done there, give it a few clicks to kind of work that stuff in there. And then the next thing I'd do is actually press the button down, then wipe the area around trying to get the frame of the phone clean as well. So for this button I already pressed down on one side, I'm going to press down on the other and try to wipe the inside of the frame of the phone with the alcohol on the Q-tip. Then when you're done wiping the button and the gap around it down as best as you can, I'd suggest that you take some canned air and sort of blow out the gap to free up any debris or dirt that you just unstuck. Once you've done that, just test the button out and you should notice that it's a lot better already, but it may not be perfect just yet. So if you have to, just repeat the same process of wiping the outside of the button as well as the inside frame around the phone. Then eventually your stuck button should actually start clicking again and you should be good to go. But for more tips and tricks like this, be sure to check out my article over on GadgetHacks.com. And as always, we'd appreciate it if you would like and comment on this video and subscribe to our channel. So we'll see you again next time, folks. But until then, happy gadget hacking.